We are gathered here today to witness a truly special ceremony, the marriage of Cody Danforth and Jennifer Keen. Cody and Jen, we are all here to offer you love, support, and encouragement as you embark on this incredible journey. I have always noticed one thing more than anything about these two. There is an ease of love that both of them put out in this world. These two only know kindness, respect, and love because that is what they were shown and that is what they were taught. Jen and Cody, your love, respect, admiration, encouragement, support, and devotion for one another radiates from both of you. Your core values and lease on life is a direct result of the people that brought you into this world. So it is safe to say that you will pass on the same example and values to your own children. Marriage is the promise between two people who love each other, who trust that love, who honor one another as individuals in that togetherness, and who wish to spend the rest of their lives as one. This ceremony will not create a relationship that does not already exist between the two of you. The ceremony commemorates how far you have come together over the last five years and honors the promises that you will make here tonight and will continue to make to each other throughout the years to come. And lastly, it takes faith to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for you both, but knowing that together you can face anything. Cody, when I was at a stage in my life not looking for a partner, you unexpectedly walked in. There's all that talk about love at first sight, and man, it surely, I surely felt it. You have the patience of a saint. You are truthfully the most genuine person I've ever met. You always have the best advice to give at the perfect time. You are without a doubt my best friend. These last five years with you have been the best of my life, and I promise to always be yours. Our future is so bright, I can't wait to wake up with your famous world's smallest smile every day. <laughs> I can't wait for our little blue-eyed, blonde-haired, athletic, slightly pigeon-toed kids. <laughs> I couldn't pick a better person to share this life with, hand in hand, for the rest of time. Jennifer. When we first reconnected that fall in Aspen five years ago, I then realized just how special you are to me. Although we didn't begin our relationship like most, we, we had to trust our gut and take a shot at love. We found love immediately and never looked back. And it was during one of those long drives back from Denver that I realized I couldn't go on without seeing you every day. You love me daily, you comfort me, you make me laugh, and somehow you always find a way to see eye to eye. I love how perfectly you fit in my arms. You have that special blend of shock and beauty. And just when I can't think you get any more beautiful, you get a new outfit that week. <laughs> you find a way to surprise me. Jennifer, our love is special and always will be. I promise to always make you smile, to make you laugh, to support and surprise you, to not get too competitive during Scrabble. And above all else, love you. Today, September 12, 2020, is our day. I will carry this love for you until the day I die. Do you, Jen, promise to honor Cody in love, to be sensitive to his needs, to comfort him in difficulty, and to put your full and com complete trust in him so as long as you both shall live? I absolutely do. Cody, do you promise to honor Jen in love, to be sensitive to her needs, to comfort her in difficulty, and to put your full and complete trust in her so as long as you both still shall live? I do. By the power vested in me in the state of Vermont, I now pronounce you as husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Thank you, Jen and Cody, for making this day happen. 
and including all of us. Jen, you found your soulmate in Cody, and I'm so happy for you. Cody, I knew from our first meeting at Chris's college graduation that you were a caring, respectful person. The fact that you asked my permission to marry Jen in person and on a golf course, no less, showed me what kind of person you are. That was the best 19th old day of my life. I'm not superstitious, but I am a little stitious. Jen, you're the best friend I could ever ask for. No one makes me laugh like you can. Now we're here today watching you marry Cody, the love of your life, and we couldn't be happier for the two of you. Cody, you are truly a gem and so perfect for Jen. Jen, you have finally met your perfect match. I love you both more than artichoke hearts and baby corns, and I can't wait to spend the next 100 years making memories with you guys as husband and wife. I love you. Cheers.